major setback for Nashville Bike Week, the motorcycle and music festival that promoters say will be held this summer in Humphreys County this September. And this comes just as authorities have issued a strongly worded warning about that event. Carrie Sharp's in the Alert Center, so there are questions, Carrie, now about whether it's even going to happen. Yeah, that's right. The late this afternoon, the Humphrey County Sheriff's Office released a warning on Facebook. According to that Facebook post, the Sheriff's Office says there is strong potential the 10 day event will not be happening. The post says the property owners where Bike Week is supposed to be held say there it's not going to be held at that location. The Sheriff's Office says they have lost confidence in this event moving forward. And this comes just one day after the State Health Department denied Bike Week's request for a required mass gathering permit. And if you read the Health Department's lengthy denial, you'll see they found Bike Week promoters have failed to arrange for some of the very basic needs for an event like this, like drinking water, toilets, lighting, medical staff, security. These are just the latest troubles for Bike Week. If you'll recall, the festival was originally going to be held at Loretta Lynn's Ranch, but earlier this year, Lynn's people backed out after they said Bike Week failed to pay the full de deposit. <clears throat> The festival's promoter, Mike Leffingwell, who also goes by the name Mike Axel, has repeatedly claimed to be stepping aside, but he really still seems to be running the show. Leffingwell not only has a lengthy criminal record, several outstanding warrants for his arrest. He is scheduled to be in court tomorrow in the Sumner County Courts on new perjury charges. Now, Bike Week promoters say they plan to resubmit their application to the state, but once they have that application in hand, by law, they cannot sell tickets, so be warned about that.